listening to the speeches of Franklin Roosevelt, yeah. and he talks about love in almost every speech. Really? Yeah. Unexpectedly, yes. He says, oh, we need love. And he talks about brotherhood. Brother, can you spare a dime? But it's all about love. Brother, can you spare nice? Brother, can you spare a dime? <laughs> I can't spare a dime, but I can spare a peanut butter sandwich. I am Franklin D. Roosevelt. And a few years before I came to president in 1929, the stock market crashed because of reckless speculation and greed. And the rich were super rich like they are today. And the poor, as we know, were destitute and dealing with the daily problem of existence. Wall Street has grown and the rich top 1% in 2011 controls over 40% of the wealth. So they've run away with it and they, they, they won't be regulated and in the 1930s I regulated Wall Street, I put them in their place, I was strong and now we've got to start from the ground up. We've got to figure out how to build a country that is more equal and where 100% of the people in the country are looked after and have a good life, not just 1%. The climate crisis, the economic crisis, the ecological crisis, how could all this crisis, which seems to be building all together, how could that become a love story? Wow. A love story? Yeah. Well, the, the, the crisis in the planet, the crisis on Wall Street, global warming, these are all things that happen when people let greed run rampant and think only of themselves. And there is only one way that we are going to change that. That is where we transition from a culture of I, where we have iPhones and iPads and iPods, and we're taught to consume, everything is for me. And we, we break that and we think of us and we realize we can't live unless we all work together. We're connected. There is no I, there's only we. And when we do that, and we all fall in love with each other, then these problems, will, we'll find a way to solve them. Beautiful, perfect. Yeah.